Okay. Ah, uh, perfect. Finally, I'm so sorry about that. No, no problem. Uh, give me one second to okay. to put your uh, camera. Oh yeah. Now I can switch to other microphone. I don't know. Yeah, now maybe. It's... Okay. It happens. So the video is working. The sound is working. Okay. Yes, except give me one second. Uh, okay. Looks like we are fine. Um, can you say Tell me when just... to go because he already challenged okay, me? Okay, yes, yes, okay. So you can uh, you can start. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. I'm gonna accept. Accept now, and the fun begins. Let's see. My move. I was told that e4 is a good move. Let me check that. E4. He, I think he usually plays Nidorf, but in Blitz, people can play anything. So he was waiting for me for a couple of minutes. So I'm going to wait for him now. <clears throat> ah, yeah. Like Magnus. Okay. Develop some pieces. I'm going to go A6. I forgot my analysis. G3. I like to bishop on g2 okay bishop to g2 e6 castle knight c6 okay what if i go h3 will he take no he would not my pawn is hanging okay what do i do i go knight e2 a little bit passive i guess castle can I go knight f4, bishop f3, queen f3? Let me try doing that. Bishop f3, queen f3. I want to open my good strong bishop for a pawn, queen d4. So let's say I go bishop e3 now. He's not going to take my pawn on b2. Where is he going with his queen? Let's say c3. Let's say a4, queen to b3. Okay, yeah, I should have played b4. Why did I play a4? That's a silly move. Okay, now I need to get rid of the knight on c6. How do I do that? It's really hard. Knight e2 and knight d Let's try that. And I keep an eye on f7 pawn in case he wants to, to move the knight. Knight e5. Oh my god, I forgot that b7 is protected. This is terrible. This is terrible. I had such a good position. Knight d4. Queen c4. Oh my god, he's so fast. My queen is completely misplaced. Let me try sacking a pawn. Queen d3. Rook d1. <coughs> queen d6. My queen officially trapped. I guess so. Queen g5. Go to end game one pawn down. Maybe I'll have my chances. I'm lower on time. I'm going to keep my bishop for now. Next move b4 or c4. I'm not sure. <clears throat> Let's say c4. Let's say knight back. I need to trade, I need to push him, push him away, try to pin. On knight f4, am I losing? No, not yet, I guess. Let's exchange some rooks, put the knight here, and come with the king. Yeah, I'm going to lose the pawn on c3. Where's my compensation? I don't have any. Bishop c3. a5. 
Okay, bishop h3, knight c5, king forward, a4 is hanging. It seems that I'm losing. Yeah, that's a bad one. Yeah, I don't see how I can possibly continue here. Yeah. I had such a good position. Why did I play a4? Should have played b4 and then a4, of course, and then queen on b3, suddenly the the best uh, blockader. Knight a4, let's lose here, so I'm going to resign. And I'm going to rematch. Now I'm black. Okay. Oh, really? Hmm. He wants to get in my head with moves like Okay, d5. I'm going to put my pieces to the center. d4, e4. I'm going to close the center. c4. Mm -hmm. His idea is that I have a hard time keeping the pawn on d5. All right, I'm going to take. Knight c3. Oh my god, I think I'm already worse. How did that happen? Knight f6. G5. Let me at least get two bishops. Is it a good idea? Is it a good idea? No, knight bd7 first and then h6. Knight e4, knight e4, famous trick. <laughs> Let's see. Next move h6. Next move h6. G2 h6 takes takes castle. At least e4 is not hanging, and I get some two bishops. And if on h6 he moves the bishop back to f4, I would have to go, I don't know, bishop to b4, I guess. A bishop on f4 at least would take away the square from the knight. Bishop d2, interesting. He wants to win the pawn on e4. That's okay. Let me attack the pawn on d4. Oh, really? He wants to sack everything. Okay, at least let me suffer for something. No, bishop f5. Don't want to sack anything. If castle queen to e7 and long castle myself. I don't want to give him initiative. We'll see if I succeed. Is e3 a threat? Not really, not yet. The bishop needs to be protected. Oh, my next move is queen d7 and e3 would win some material. Okay. He goes knight f4 now and go g5. That looks like like a win to me. He goes e3, I go queen d7. That also looks like a win to me. Okay, now I'm better. So he would have to come up with something brilliant. e3, okay. Queen d7 maybe? Knight f4. So he's ready to sack material. Okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I forgot about that square. That's embarrassing. Okay, is my pawn on e4 hanging? Probably yes. So I have to place my queen on e6 now. And I'm gonna definitely castle long. Long castle, long castle seems like logical continuation. Or d5 now. d5 now. Queen e5. a4. Interesting. A4, A6, Knight D5, Knight D5, let's say Queen D5, Castle short, okay, Bishop to D6, that's a good square for my Bishop. Rook F to C1, Rook A4, okay. Short castle, rook c4 and c6. I'm gonna blow everything, rook to e8. 
going to e6, okay, to d8. Put everything to the center. Knight to the center as well. Queen goes, okay. e4 is hanging. Okay, let, no, takes not good, h5. You want to go f3? No, h4. I don't think he wants to go f3. Okay, h3, g4. Uh, takes. I want to um, dominate on white squares. Okay. Oh, sorry, I almost clicked resign. I want to offer a draw to him. I don't like this nonsense of playing on time. I really don't like it. Hate this one. I really don't like this. Oh my goodness, misclick. One second, come on. I don't like it. Okay, so that's how he wants to play. At least, at least I managed to outplay him in my, not defense, that's not the right word. At least I outplayed him, and the only way for him to beat me was to, to win on time. Actually, yeah, I would like to address this issue because uh, I never actually trained this skill for a, of playing pre-move stuff, you know. And the reason for that is I really don't know where else except online blitz this skill would be necessary, you know. Um, like in all the tournaments we're playing, there's always uh, increment or, or at least a delay. So I have no idea when when on earth would I need uh, this kind of skill to, to play quickly, prepared moves in advance. And that's why I never really trained it. And well, now apparently I'm paying the consequences, but that's okay. That is okay. If I lose the match because he is a faster clicker, then, then I'm very fine with that. Okay. I'm not sure what to do next. I'm just developing my pieces to some reasonable place. Oh my God. <laughs> I forgot that I moved the queen to d2 just a second ago. Okay. <laughs> End game. Okay. Let's play some one pawn down empty. Let's check his technique. Knight goes somewhere. I'm gonna put my knight on c6. I'm going to push h4 and bother his pawn on e5. Rook d2, double rooks, and maybe bishop h3. Wait a second, can I double rooks? I think I can. Is there a threat? Knight b8 may be a threat. Mm -hmm. It's not good. Knight e1, I want to protect my rook just in case. Now f3, h5 is sort of... Knight is, rook is protected. Yeah, my next move is f3. And then exchange that bad bishop. I, and then we'll see what happens. 
Knight on e1 is terrible. Let me fix that. Oops, knight b8 and I lose. This is embarrassing. Ah, no, I don't lose. I'm still in the game. Sort of. Yeah, I'm going to just do nothing. Let's see how is he going to make progress here. Yeah, I have too many weaknesses, I suppose, to hold on. B4 and H4, and that's at Suk's one? No, I still have bishop E1, bishop. Yeah, that's the way to win, bishop to E1. Now I'm... Now he goes to b6, and then he goes a3. And that's the way to win, I suppose. Yeah, I have to take knight takes. Knight to b1. Yeah, that's resignable. h4 pawn. Yeah, there's no point in continuing. H4 is hanging. Bishop F2. Knight D2. Knight G2. Game over, guys. Yeah, here he definitely outplayed me. Well, I blundered the pawn, but yeah. Yeah, no ideas. Just resign. There's no fortress at all. Yes, I'm going to resign. Three to zero. Okay. One draw. One draw is what I need. Knight h3 again. Okay. Let's try e5 this time. And uh, knights and d5 again. And let me try literally the same. Because I got a good position. Let's see where's his improvement. Check probably, no. Where's the improvement? I like my position, I don't know. Hmm. F3, really? Is this really what he wants to play? And he takes F E4, I guess. takes f e4 h3 okay e takes f h takes bishop goes there really bishop to b4 let's say a castle he castles long i suppose but then i take on c3 and his king would be exposed what did they play on e5 takes bishop g4 is it worth it doesn't seem to that way takes bishop g4 queen f4 knight d5 let's ah let's have some fun let's have some fun it's blitz after all Yeah, honestly, I don't think it, it should work, but at least I'm attacking queen f4, knight d5, queen g4, knight e3, queen e4. Yeah, and that's it. So queen f4, maybe taking on c3. Would it work? I don't think so. Knight c3, yeah, take on e3. That's exactly what we both calculated. Maybe bishop to c5. Can I make that work? Keep my knight on e3. Okay, but how do I make any progress? King h8 definitely useful. I want to have f5 possibilities, but f5 e takes. Let's go f5. 
let's give more material come on knight g6 knight f8 let's do this knight g6 knight f8 queen f8 queen b7 rook b8 <coughs> E takes F is just an easy win, I suppose. Just E takes F. Ah, okay. Queen F3. This should be an easy win too. Okay, Queen E7. I'm gonna take the pawn on E5 if he lets me. If he goes E6. I really don't know what to do. C6, I guess. C6. I'm gonna go B5. Okay, I need to develop some pieces. Rook D8. King E2. Um, B6. He's gonna give up his rook. Okay. Important check. And again, and there's no point in continuing. I'm gonna resign. Knight h3, okay. He wants to get some views of how to beat GM with uh, knight h3 move. Okay, I'm still gonna play uh, by the book. Let's try again the same line. Okay, neither for this. Maybe neither. I used to analyze this line. Hold on a second. It was a long time ago. Let's check, I think. What if I do this? Let's say I do this. Let's say I do this. Let's say I do this. Some boring chess. Oh my god, he just had knight b4, completely winning. <laughs> this is embarrassing. d4. Mm -hmm. He wants to push d3. I have to react, but I cannot push my c pawn because he's gonna go. So I have to take cd, he takes cd. Or knight takes. Knight takes, maybe I can hold this one. Okay. It's far from a draw, but at least I have normal position where I can understand what to do. Boring and Boring. Let's go to Rook and King. What's this? Okay. I blundered now. He blunders. What is happening? Let's see if I can convert this advantage to a full point, full point before. This is a technically winning position. I know he just misclicked, I suppose. B6 he meant. Rook a8, sad but necessary. H4. Fixing some weaknesses on the king side. I'm gonna give you that pawn. I'm gonna push my pawn to a7, and that should be enough to win. And okay, so he's pushing his h pawn, but I don't believe that. Check, king, e4, h4, d5, g4, d6, h3, d7, h takes g, d8, and that should be a mate. I just should have just played f3, this is... He doesn't promote with a check because they did not recapture. And I've seen a mate like this, like this, 
Where's my mate? Where's my mate? Come on. I've seen this and I do this and then I do this. Okay. Woohoo! One win. <laughs> yeah, okay. I lost on time, blundered the pawn. Now it's time he returned the favor, I suppose. Okay. Very simple, boring chess is what I'm going to try to do. Simple, boring chess. Just boring. Boring chess. Okay. E6. That's definitely boring. E6. Rook E8. Bishop to B7. Knight BD7. Some boring stuff. Really? What about the pawn on D4? If I take everything. Okay. Okay. Mm, D4 pawn is weak. How do I use it? Is he going to push d5? Probably he's going to push d5. Okay. So knight f6 for sure. Bishop moves back. And then queen c7, d5. That is the problem. I have no good place for my queen. Hmm. Rook c8. I'm expecting d5. Any, any moment now. I think I can do this now. I was playing takes, takes, rookie one, rookie one, and then c5. Let's see. Oh, c5, d6. Ouch. Ah, that's too bad. Oh, at least that pawn is not promoting, I suppose. That's good news. b4. How do I hold that pawn? 97. It's a position. He's so strong, guys. <clears throat> Fast and strong. And the play is so easy for him. Just take the pawn. Just take everything, I suppose. Take everything. Or queen a4 or knight d5, no, knight d5, queen d6. <clears throat> yeah, just take everything exactly as I suspected. Okay, what are my chances after rook c8? Bishop moves back, takes. Do I have knight e5 ideas? Is that dangerous? Knight e5, at least for blitz, that should be enough. Queen d5. Don't I have a fork or something? Let's say takes. Let's say fork. Rook d8. Oh my god. Oh, I blundered bishop e7. It's bad. Check rook d8, bishop f8. Should I get, let him give me mate? Rook d7, rook c8, bishop f8, bishop f8, rook d5, and mate. Uh, it's very hard. If I take on c1, he takes my rook and promotes. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to let him checkmate me. There you go. I still not a checkmate. Okay. Mm. I need something very boring. What is boring? Not London system, I suppose. Okay. I'm not going to play boring chess. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. We had similar structures just a minute ago. Uh, I'm going to just, you can take it. 
I'm going to move my bishop to f2. I'm going to attack his knight on f5. I used to have six years ago very similar position with uh, young Shishtov Duda. And it was, he didn't move the, the uh, bishop on f5, but it was really hard to play for black. Really just attack the pawn. Bishop goes to e7, just b3, c4. The pawn on h4 always needs protection. So I learned that this is not a pleasant position to play for black. Okay. Now I need to secure my king. What is the best way to do it? Probably rook two. Okay, f6. Do I take and help him? Nope. He's gonna take. I'm gonna take with which pawn? With this pawn. I wanna open up my bishop a little bit. Rook g1, prophylactics. Then maybe rook to a2 just to be safe. <laughs> Boring chess. Knight d8. Where is he going? To g4. Okay, a4. Even if he gets to g4. Bishop to d4. It's just one check. It's just one check. What else can he do? Attack f4 pawn, very hard. I'm just gonna push my pawns. Queen goes there. Okay. Rook c1 then. F2 is a fork, but I don't see how he can possibly make it work. Queen to e2. I wanna go a5. Oh, bishop to d8. Okay. B takes, queen takes. B takes, queen takes. Rook b1. Why am I not taking that knight? Remind me, guys, his queen is busy. Yeah, <laughs> because it's too late to take his knight. Okay, bishop back to f2. Knight is coming to d4. What is he gonna do? Queen a4. He can just go all in. Yeah, it seems that's a very good practical decision. Knight d4. Attacking e6, c6. Some check. And there should be a crushing combination. Like knight b5, I guess. No, queen c6. Rook to c1 first. I oh, know he has queen g6 and I have to come back. Uh-huh. How do I crush here? C7? No. Knight C knight b5? Queen g6. No. Rook c2. C7. And is now knight b5 working? Not yet. Double rooks. Knight b5 is my next move. And then some bishop b6 should decide. Knight g4, bishop g1. Nothing happening there. Knight b5. c7 is the threat. What can he do about that? Not much. Is bishop b6 a win? He resigned. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I need some, some boring chess with pawn chains in the center. <laughs> or a blunder, like in that rook end game. Okay. <laughs> At least he shows me some respect, I suppose. Okay, knight f6. C3. I actually wanted to play Slav myself, so let's see. 
G6. This is F5. Boring chess. End game. Bishop back to C8. Before A6. Knight B3, Knight BD7. Boring passive fun chess. That's what I'm gonna do. Mm, knight h5. Bishop c7, really? Okay. Castle. Huh. Rook e8 and e5. Is it a good strategically? I doubt it. f6 and e5. Oh my god. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> This is crazy. <laughs> oh my God, this is embarrassing. Okay, I'm gonna resign like he in previous one. <laughs> I had a good position, I blundered knight. This is ridiculous. Okay, what did I do last time? D4, let's repeat. Mm, knight of three. Okay, e3, that's definitely boring. h3, two bishops, c3, e5, bishop b5, bishop d6. Okay, what if I just take and I do like this and then I do like this? And then knight f6, and then I castle, and then I go bishop, then I go b3, g3, he wants knight f4, so queen c2. So he's building a battery, he wants just to checkmate me, just like that. Pretty straightforward. Am I afraid of knight, queen d6, knight h4? Okay, let me go f4 bother him a little bit on the queen side. Should I be scared of that? Uh-huh. Okay, so his plan is excruciatingly clear. Why did I weaken myself? Okay, king g2, that's fine. Knight e5 takes, bishop takes, okay. This should be seven, this should be two. Rook d1, rook e1. Bishop e2, bishop f3, h5, h4. Okay, mm, I guess I would go c4 now. This should be two queen. Oh, really? Okay, I take on e5, then I take with the queen. Solid position. What do I do with my solid position? And just push b4. Pawn minority attack, as they say. Takes. Okay. Mm, takes. Rook b1. And b4. Oh, why didn't I take the long diagonal? Should have taken the long diagonal. Let me do that now. Let me do that now. Queen b2 looks weird. Okay, I'm gonna take. And I'm gonna push a5. Queen c3. Very nasty pin for him. Not sure what to do with it, but that's, that's a hard one to unpin from. Queen b2. What is he doing? Queen b7. Queen back to b2. Queen c3. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> oh my god. The whole game is so good. And then just one move, queen. queen. Okay, did I click rematch? Yes, I did. Knight h3 again. No. Okay, thank you. 
Oh my God. I did it too. C6, B4, E6, A5. I don't know what I'm doing. I just random moves. Is he going to go B5? No. Takes, takes. Okay. Now let's just fix it. Let's fix it and see what happens. Bishop E7. It's going to push E4. We're going to exchange a little bit. Exchange a little bit. Okay. I just not blundering. <laughs> that is my goal. Okay. Queen to e7, is it a good move? Probably not. Maybe knight to d5 is good. Really? c3, what about f5? Knight g5, knight c3, knight b1. Ah, let's go. Let's go. Knight c3, queen c2, knight b1, knight e6. Same number of material. What if I protect my pawn and then go h6, g5? That could be better. Queen e1, I did not see this move. Why? Don't ask. Please don't. How can I trick him? Yeah. Queen d6, I should do. Knight e5. He's really well at regrouping his pieces. What do I do with this bishop on d c8? It's horrible. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Mm, yeah, it's a horrible position. I really don't know what even a, what move to play. C3 is a weakness. Like D7, H6, King H6, I suppose. But G6 is coming. It's awful. Rook E8. C4. I have to take. I have to move my queen to c7, goes to e5, rook to b8, a6, let's take, don't like that bishop anyway, e6 is weak I suppose, but really, okay, wow. Is this really working? Oh, yes, it does. It does a lot. Now that's it. The queen comes to g6. Is it the last game? I know, eight and a half is the score. Okay. How can I not lose immediately here? Like this? Only miracle would save me. Oh, I thought he would move the king. Resign. Okay, a two. Not a very beautiful score. Okay, I'm white. What did we do last time? D4, knight f6, c4, e6, g3, knight c6, knight f3, rook b8. Okay, knight c3, a6. His plan is very clear, but I'm gonna hit the center. That's what you're supposed to be doing when your opponent is playing on the side of the board. Okay, e4, knight e1, knight d3, b4, c5. What's next? I don't know, a4, a5. What's next? I haven't figured that out yet. 
should do a3, maybe create some tension on d6, rook b1, uh, queen b3. I'm planning for b5. b5 now, yep. Let's do this. Oh, really? cd, bishop takes, b6. Okay, I'm definitely winning here, but uh, I know he's a very strong player, so we'll see what he will figure out. I'm gonna block his everything like this. What's my next move? Rook c1, I guess. Bishop goes maybe to f3. He wants to go g4, then we'll talk. And we we'll move the bishop to e2. Just prevent him from counterplay. That's usually the trick. Bishop e2. Rook bc1 is my next move. Knight is going to g5. Okay, I don't mind. Let it be. Queen d1. Why didn't play queen d1 immediately? I don't know. Knight f3. I'm gonna take another pawn. Okay, he takes f. Should g4. Okay, his pieces get out a little bit, I suppose. And now my king is exposed. Takes, takes, and f3. Not a little. His pieces got out completely. Bishop check, king h1, rook f8. Knight e4, I've, no, knight e4 loses. Wait a minute. Bishop h6, queen e2. King h1. He's not afraid of the pin. My rook is hanging. Okay, rook to d1 then. Knight e4. Knight d4, I'm gonna go to an end game. If not, what's my next move? D6. Yeah, I'm gonna push D6. I have it some check possibilities. Oh my god, my knight was hanging on E4. <laughs> this is horrible. This is just terrible. Queen D5. This embarrassing level of play ah, on my behalf, of course. <clears throat> What's my next move? Knight. Let's go this. If there's a mate, there's a mate. What am I going to do about it? <clears throat> Rook f7, queen f7, take everything. Seems like a mate. No, rook f7, bishop e5 check. Queen e5, knight e5, knight d7, knight e4, rook e1. This should be a win, but he's going to play very quickly now. Of course he will. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <clears throat> Again, I outplay him and yeah, okay, there's no moment here. Even my knight is trapped. That's the last game. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Chess24 Premium account. Uh, I have it. I like it. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed this beating of myself but i had some several good games thanks for watching and sorry for all the blunders <laughs>
Uh, Hello. Hey, thanks. Yeah. Sorry for, yeah. Sorry for what? <laughs> no, no, I mean, <laughs> sorry for uh, this confusion at the beginning. I mean, it's... No, but that's my fault. I did not check my camera. I... No, no, it's okay. It's okay. It doesn't matter. It, it was absolutely fine after you <laughs> switched it on. So, yeah, I'm glad. okay. I mean, uh, thanks. Thanks for playing. Thank you. Take okay. Care. Enjoy. Bye.